Floating wind turbine is playing a significant role in producing clean and renewable energy everywhere on the planet. However, the safety of the complex and large-scale structure and its long-term reliability remain to be a big challenge for academia and industry. Nevertheless, the strong wind resources in the deeper water and unlimited spaces for producing multi-megawatt electricity make this challenge to be attractive. Floating wind turbine design require a powerful numerical tools that need to be validated using the experimental results. Due to the large scale of this floating wind turbine, all experiments were scaled down and only few full scales have been conducted. The scaled models were usually subjected to the simultaneous wind and wave load using the water tank and a large fan aside. However, scaling down using the Fraudy scaling method, which is usually used for scaling the ocean structures, results in inaccuracy modeling the wind load on the turbine due to the lower Reynolds numbers. To address this conflict in scaling, real-time hybrid simulation was proposed by simulating wind load numerically and testing the floating wind turbine including platform, mooring lines and wind tower experimentally subjected to the simulated wind loads using the actuation system. However, the physical substructures still need to be scaled down. As a PhD student, I am developing a distributed real-time hybrid simulation which can break the scaling limits and laboratory capabilities by combining two large laboratories in a single wind turbine, uh, floating wind turbine experiment. For example, testing the platform in the water tank subject to the realistic wave load and testing wind tower in the wind tunnel to yield more accurate wind loads. Alternatively, the large out outdoor shake table may be used to impose the boundary conditions between the substructures, making the full-scale experiments for full uh, floating wind turbine possible. Also, the developed method can be easily extended for testing the multi-turbine single platform structures by testing the several physical substructures in the different distributed wind tunnels and water tank. Thank you.